Um, in this video I would like to talk about Thomas Sowell and the way I see it is probably the, the greatest American ever. Um, he's not the greatest person um, with an American nationality <clears throat> because from this point of view we could say that um, William Pierce had a cosmetheist point of view and he he was secondarily American he was uh, the consciousness of the cosmos partly um, Philip K. Dick he was American but it was contingent his essence was mystical Neil Walsh is also contingently American but his essence in his writings is unity with God so these three persons are accidentally American whereas Thomas Sowell is essentially American he embodies and reflects and illustrates um, the truth about America which is a country of, of violence and and suffering but also greatness and um, what is great about Thomas Sowell is that um, he made a, a dialectical negation of the negativity inherent in America he negated the negative to speak in Hegelian terms in the sense that he was black and Afro-American and he carried with him all the, the tragedy and the suffering of blacks in America and at the same time he adopted the ideology of of white America which is libertarianism and um, he became a black American with a white mindset but since the essence of libertarianism although historically it has been um, it has been uh, developed by whites but the, the essence of libertarianism is that when you are a libertarian you abandon your racial characteristics and you belong to universality the idea of freedom so to say that libertarianism is a white um, a white ideology is true from the empirical um, empirical standpoint but from the the conceptual standpoint it's not true and the proof is that blacks can be libertarians and um, Thomas Sowell negated the negativity inherent in America and he acknowledged that um, he, he did not fantasize about a past where blacks were free from white oppression he accepted this oppression as a part of the historical process but he recognized the greatness in what was opposed to him and therefore he incorporated this greatness within him and made peace with the negative in America and uh, yeah so he he made the Aufhebung uh, to, to negate and to preserve that's the Hegelian dialectical uh, trick he made the Aufhebung of, of, of white America not by having any hatred against white America but on the contrary as incorporating into himself um, the greatest aspect of, of white America and therefore he became the embodiment of the greatness of, of America uh, he was free from resentment and he acknowledged uh, the greatness of, of this country and um, and uh, he deserves credit for that and yeah that's um, well done well done to, to him Thank you.